Hi everyone, it's Melissa, and today I am going to be doing the small booktuber tag, which looks like a lot of fun. So thanks to Angie for tagging me, Angie from The Science Mama. I will link her channel below. So let's get right into it. So the first question is to introduce yourself. So some non-bookish things about me. Um, I went to school for science. Um, I got my bachelor's in science and my master's in science as well. Um, I specialized in like environment and ecology and I did my master's degree um, specializing in um, pollination. So I spent lots of time outdoors surrounded by bees and looking very closely <laughs> um, at flowers. So that's a little bit about um, my background, or I guess my academic background, because I didn't stay in science. I, um, I've been working for an environmental uh, nonprofit for the past, oh my gosh, eight or nine years now. Um, most of the work I've been doing in that time has been um, as like someone doing outreach to like schools. And yeah, so I've been an environmental slash outdoor educator for many, many years, um, and recently have moved up to management level. So I don't get outside as much as I used to. So maybe a little bit about me that's not like career or school focused. I am um, an amateur swing dancer. So very amateur, it's a hobby, but I do teach um, at the local swing dance club um, in the small city where I live. And I'm missing it terribly. We're not allowed to do that right now because of social distancing. And based on our province's like long-term plan, like they have like phases for things reopening, it looks like we're probably not going to be allowed to like do partner dances for maybe a year or more than a year. So I'm really bummed about that because dance is actually a big part of my life. But yeah, those are those are the the main things about me. Like science, like dancing, like books. So question number two is how long have you um, been on BookTube? And oh, I should have checked. I think my first video was like the end of February. So it's been like just shy of three months or it might be exactly three months now, about three months. Question three is what kind of videos do you like to make? Because I'm so new, I haven't made a ton of different types of videos and I haven't had the opportunity to experiment much yet. But based on what I have done, um, I really enjoy wrap-ups and reviews because I like talking about books and like that's the reason I created a booktube channel. Um, but I also really like TBRs and I think it's just like the anticipation of reading something new and like sharing that with people. And I've liked making lists since I was a little kid. So the, um, yes, yeah, so I really enjoy TBRs as well. Things that I haven't had a chance to do yet, but I would like to um, try, or I'm like looking forward to trying, are try chapters. I've um, watched quite a few of those and I enjoy watching them and they seem like they would be really fun to make as well. And the other type of video that I haven't really done much of yet, I think I might have like one video, um, are more like recommendations videos or like kind of like um, sharing my favorites of like certain genres or like at the end of the year, I'm already looking forward to like making like a list of my favorite books of the year. Um, so yeah, I'd like to share more of like my favorites and recommendations and that kind of stuff. Question four is what do you like about booktube? And there's uh, two main things, I guess. So I don't have a ton of like bookish people in my real life like, I mean, like, really avid readers. Um, so I don't really have people to share my opinions opinions with. So this is a great way where I can just basically shout out my phone about <laughs> my opinions on books and then, like, share them with people. So that's, like, the major one, um, the major thing I really love about BookTube. But also, I really like the community aspect, and I feel like... Um, in terms of like YouTube audiences, BookTube has really good engagement. I have no numbers to back this up, but it feels like there's a there's good engagement. Um, people send, tend to um, comment, and I also find comments on BookTube 
videos for the most part more thoughtful. Um, like there's been some effort put into them. So I really like um, the engagement in in booktube video like in the comments which you can't really say that about many YouTube videos. So question five is what types of books do you read? So I think I read fairly broadly or I, I guess I should say I don't tend to discriminate over types of books or at least not purposefully. Um, but if you've watched some of my other videos, I have mentioned that I'm coming off of quite a long reading hiatus. So I've missed many years of reading and therefore there are lots of types of books that I just haven't got around to reading yet. And actually I think I'm going to make a video on this topic in the next couple of weeks. So I'll talk more about that. But for my favorite books, um, that I'm, that I read a lot of right now would be nonfiction and I gravitate specifically to science nonfiction and nature nonfiction. I kind of lump those together, um, as well as memoirs. And I also really like, um, I don't read a ton of fantasy, but I really like magical realism and things like with fantastical elements. Um, I enjoy historical fiction. I enjoy classics, although I'm very underread in my classics, which is something I am working very hard to remedy. And I also enjoy um, middle grade books. Um, I like books set or written in the 20s and 30s. And also kind of, I don't know if this is niche or not, but I really enjoy books that explore grief um, as a theme. Question number six is, what is your favorite video that you have made so far? Um, I would say that... It, oh my gosh, I don't know what it was called, but it was like, I suggested comfort reads. Um, this was right when everyone was going into like quarantine slash isolation slash lockdown. Um, and people were feeling, feeling very anxious. And a lot of people were like looking for comforting reads. So I made a video about comfort reads, but that's not why I liked it. Um, what I really liked about that book was I did it. Um, I filmed it in bits and, in bits and pieces over a week, which I hadn't done before. And I interspersed it with like, out well, actually, I think I did it all outside. So I kind of like walked around and like took little short video snippets of nature um, and the outdoors as I explored like my yard and like down the road and stuff. And I'm a very outdoorsy person and I like nature a lot. Um, and I like the kind of like just kind of sporadic nature of making that video where I would literally be outside and if I thought of something like, oh, okay, this would be a good um, topic about, or this would be a good type of book to read for comfort reading, I would take out my phone and I would um, make a video. So yeah, I really liked that video because it was something very different and also it featured the outdoors. So I would say that one was probably my favorite to film. And the last question, number seven, is to tag people. So... I'm going to go with, oh, I can't remember who's already been tagged to do this. Um, but if you haven't already been tagged, I'll choose two booktube channels. So I'll tag Scott and Nell from Gunpowder Fiction and Plot and Tara from Buzzword Books. But if you have a smaller YouTube channel and you want to do this tag, then consider yourself tagged and please um, comment below so I can go watch your video. So this was a lot of fun. Um, I hope you enjoyed it. And as always, I hope everyone is doing well. And we'll talk to you soon. Take care.